Let's learn how to do some batch renaming. Here I am in the uh, content pane. To rename a single file, all I have to do is just click on the name and then press tab to move to the next name, rename, press tab, so forth. So this is a quick way to name files one by one. But there's another way you can use. Uh, we can do a batch rename. So we're going to select all of our files first thing I'm going to do is click on the first file and then I'm going to hold my shift key down and click on the last one. That selects all of them. An alternative to that is to hit Control A or Command A on a Mac and that will select all as well. We'll go up into the Tools menu and select Batch Rename. That brings up a dialog. Um, here we can do a preset or save a preset. Here we can just rename files or we can uh, move them to another folder when we rename them or we can copy them to another folder when we rename them. Down in the next section, um, this is where the renaming happens. There's much we can do here. Look at this drop down. Um, explore it. Over on the right side, we can delete or add steps in the renaming thing. So for this one, I'd like to rename these files Seasons. So I'm going to type Seasons and underscore. And rather than a date, I'm going to choose a sequence number. So they'll be named 1, 2, 3, 4. And I'm going to choose a two-digit sequence number. All right. And I can see a preview down below of what the number, uh, what the names are going to look like once I rename them. I'll click Rename and the files will go away for just a moment and now they are all renamed. So this is quickly done in Bridge. I can right mouse button click on a file and choose Reveal in Finder and that will open up the folder and you can see that all the files have been renamed.